Thanks so much, Becky. Well, joining us from our remote downtown studio is Superintendent for the Kansas Highway Patrol, Colonel Herman Jones. Good morning, and thanks for joining us. Uh, good morning. Good morning, Dave. How are you doing today? Well, thanks again for coming in. Now, Governor Kelly said something last week in her remarks about long-term problems at KHP. Some of that was before your move to that agency just over a year ago, but how bad do you think it is right now? Well, hopefully it's not as bad as it has been, or should I say, what we're trying to do is just make some adjustments with the, uh, some of the culture and some of the, uh, uh, the direction we want to go. Uh, I, I've come in uh, by the appointment of the, of the governor to basically to, uh, to change uh, administration and operations and some other things like that. We've got a lot of dedicated people that work for the Highway Patrol, and, and that's what my, my goal is, to make sure that we're working for the best of them and for the people of this state. Now, what can you tell me this morning about the firing of Majors Harrington and Kellerman? Well, you know, those are personnel matters there, and uh, basically there was, a, uh, there was just a need for a change in administration, and that was the, uh, the actions that we took. Uh, obviously, not even going into great details with those type of things right there. I wish them very, uh, very much the best in, in their endeavors from here on out, uh, but it was just, uh, as I would say, a separation there of uh, 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 the culture and uh, and just the, the efficiency of what we wanted to, to see for the, for the organization there. So that's what we were trying to achieve, or that's what we, we've been trying to work for. Now, we do have to touch on this. There's been some allegations against you, including sexual harassment, misuse of a state plane, and gender mm -hmm. discrimination. What do you have to say on those topics? Well, you know, uh, obviously I, I'm very fortunate that we've had uh, two different uh, investigations, and it shows that I, I think what, what comes from that is just misunderstanding, misinterpretation uh, of, of actions and things that we go with that. And I, I, I get that. I realize that there are some people that read things wrong or read, uh, misinterpret uh, some actions from that. I, I will take responsibility of uh, the things that I do, uh, but uh, I, I think that my, uh, some people aren't as friendly as maybe what I would be. And for that, then, I, I recognize that and understand that. And just a lot of it is just making sure we have uh, a clear communication uh, on both sides there. Now, the governor does kind of back you up in that term on uh, saying that there were really nothing found here through the investigation, but the Troopers Association is saying something completely different. What response do you have on that? Well, what I say to that is uh, that's their voice. Uh, I, I would say that the investigation shows uh, the, uh, quite a bit of information and for individuals to speak out many a times they're speaking out for the information that they have I would say that they don't not uh, they do not speak for the governor's office they do not speak for me uh, and I, I I just everybody has their opinion and I go for that. <clears throat> As Colonel Herman Jones from KHP as always sir thank you so much for your time.